Hi, hello, it's art stream time. It took me a second to get set up, but we're here. Um, I do have a couple emote slots that I still have open, but I think I'm gonna do more like art study shit today. So I can, you, you, you know, A, get some practice, B, spend some time thinking up actual ideas for what to do with the emotes. I got like a couple things in mind for the other, like, bit tier stuff, but. I'll worry about that later. It's whatever. Who give a shit? So I am getting some reference stuff, but I think I might do a little bit of figure drawing. Well, I'm waiting for that all to download. I mean, it shouldn't take too long, but still. I'm gonna bring up my... Practice for that. And that can get everything all good to go. There we go. And also, obviously, music. Turn that off while I'm grabbing that. Please. Just the usual. Oh, she laughed though. Oh, she quite loud for me. I think, uh, I mean, not too loud in stream, but probably gonna be taken down just a little bit. There we go. That's a bit better. But good morning, yellow. Good to see you. Let's do some gesture drawing. Let's see. I think some 30 second ones would be good. Ideally, no, no nudity so I don't get banned on uh, the Twitch. Thank you very much. I, I would appreciate that. Right. I sure did not like start a new canvas for this, so that's like fine. <laughs> We're just, you know, it's accepting that. Not at all the right, like, fan <laughs> either, but... Sometimes, sometimes it's life. It's... I don't know if I've ever, like, started anything in my life ever without immediately realizing, oh shit, I forgot something entirely essential. It's, uh, it's just how it goes. All this does make me want to do, like, the figure drawing class again, because those are useful, but, like, I think expect to use physical media, and, like, I, 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 I don't, mm, I don't really... I mean, there are some there where you can just, like, do whatever the fuck you want. I could probably, like, I could probably bring, like, my iPad over or my laptop or whatever. <laughs> but, you know. One of these days. I do look relatively- Hey, thank you for the host, Kazik! Good to see you! I do live relatively close to somewhere that would do that kind of thing, so, I mean... Well, he's I do wish it showed the timer on screen, but I guess I kind of understand. I, we never, like, in class, 
new we we got like some time warnings for like when it's like halfway done and that shit but i've got a relatively good sense of time but th that's like the only thing <laughs> for me that i've got like that i can just tell when like a minute has passed i i don't have a good reaction time i don't have great spatial sense um Timing, though. Timing's pretty good. I I don't know if that's just all the rhythm games I played. I say that like I played like quote unquote real rhythm games. I I, I played the easy ass ones on like phones, and I'm so you know, <laughs> I'm not like good at them. But you know, you know. One well, of these days I'll get good at, like, uh, PC, arcade, rhythm games, but... God, they're a lot! And the disconnect between, like, um... Hands and screen fucks with me. Like, using buttons for that just feels weird. Cause, like, I just want to see the notes and t touch the screen so it... <laughs> It's, there's like as little thought as possible and it's all the like flow state maximum efficiency but I can't have that if I want to actually uh, get good at like pop music or sh whatever <laughs> definitely played like a couple songs in that at like anime conventions it was like wow this is like really hard Respect that they have something in here where the body is so obscured. <laughs> it's like, what? Fuck. <laughs> See, you know, the shoulders going down like that. So my, my, that kind of shape was not at all. But it's also, it's like a really baggy outfit too. I don't really, mm, that's kind of... There's also, I need to like work on storyboarding stuff, so I have to, have to submit to like <laughs> studios and maybe get a job in animation like I um, got a degree for. Uh, yeah, it's, it's nice, it's like kosher for me to do that on stream, which I think it would be fine. I would just have to be very careful about who I show it to so they're not like, oh shit! You're like a VTuber. Sorry, we, do, we don't hire those. And in fact, I'm going to dox you as a VTuber hater. I think that would happen. Call me a clown. People out there are spiteful. They will end your life, given the opportunity. The ad out like no, that could be fun though. Just like ray up a concept to do a storyboard on before stream and then just go on for it. It'd be a good use of my time when I'm because like I'm running out of emotes to your emote slots to fill. Literally will not get any more until and if I become partnered. So like I got something else other than just a drawing as much as I like it. I do want to do some landscapes today. Which primarily because I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. It would be weird like that. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I just like I am entirely joking. Obviously. I hope I hope that's clear. But like I would love there to be someone who like 
would recognize such a, like, minor and significant VTuber. I don't mean that in, like, a self-deprecating sense. I mean that in, like, a... I'm not, you know, popular enough that someone in real life would be likely to notice me, you know? But, like, um... Would, would know me, but would also hate VTubers. I think that'd be really funny. Imagine what kind of life you'd be living. AP, check it for the raid! Once I have a sec here, I am gonna- oh wait! No, the stop session just completely stops it. Actually, I could probably quickly get in. And welcome, Kevin, welcome, KagaVT! Hey, 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 Peach Raid, let's fucking go! I hope you had a good stream! Like I said, I'll give you a shout in a sec, but in the meantime, tell me what you were- Okay, this is a good time. Just start a new one, let's go! Nailed this! Hell yeah, another art streamer. Let's go! Hope things went well for you. It's getting started. This is so obscured. Ma'am, please! Hi, Kane. Welcome, welcome, welcome. <laughs> Ma'am, I don't know. And Mercy Art, thank you for the follow. Oh, it's this guy again! I like this guy. He makes me feel welcomed and loved. He's the kind of guy who inadvertently becomes d d your other dad. X-Man again! I wasn't even looking at the game as I started with the like. <laughs> he's not a genius, apparently. He's doing like a- he's kind of like the put pointed like that. I, I want to know who that guy is. He's got good stock. Good vibes. Poster man for Lord of the Rings. I mean, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Starts doing uh, gesture drawing streams, falls in love with one of the mod. <laughs> well, more so just getting emotionally attached. <laughs> Life of an artist. That, that, I sure got a lot of detail in there. Oh, it's this person again. <laughs> Although, we definitely, you know, it could be someone else just in the same outfit. I wouldn't fucking know. So, uh, again, I get this as, like, a gesture drawing ex exercise. I get how this is, like, very useful. It's... It, it, <laughs> first time I saw this model, assuming it's even the same person, was kind of a, a shock. Polar opposite of all the people in, like, the really drapey outfits where you can't really... Judge their pose. <laughs> it's like, oh, you want to see me? Oh, but you selected clothed? Good try, idiot. Here's the fucking grudge. <laughs> King's so distracted. Just like, not even. <laughs> Let's go for 60 seconds. But hell yeah, just here's fun. Um, I, I'm, I'm not gonna do, like, a whole selection of these. This is just, like, warm-up. And Peach, I give her the follow! Or should I say Peach? Yeah, 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 I'll do 20, uh, 60 seconds. Yeah, that sounds right. I would say anyone can do these exercises. You, you there, like, there is a little bit of technique to it and that, like, makes it easier to do, like, these super fast and get like the idea of the pose down but they're i mean honestly they're good for learning anatomy i would argue because you have to like really uh quickly judge what's going on um it is good to have an understanding of it though so definitely like if it is accessible to you or if you can literally just find them on youtube take like anatomy courses, especially if you can find, like, a class for, like, literally this exact kind of thing, because you will learn that. You'll learn good, like, notation for this, which I'm not really using right now. This is just a bunch of, much of scribbles, but s s sometimes, some sometimes that's good. Here's the ball. Sometimes it's more... I, I will say, 
Um, gesture drawing is a lot more about like the motion of the pose versus like strict anatomical accuracy. It's meant to like improve like ha how you pose characters, people, you know, in whatever you do. So you can get down to like more of the core of like what that pose is instead of it just being like really stiff. In terms of learning anatomy, it like it does help, like I said, but um if you really want to get down to the gritty shit with that, you would want to do more of like a proper anatomy study and like really spend time on stuff. So, yeah, these are good for loosening up poses, good for warm-ups. So absolutely you should do them, but hopefully that made like any sense at all. <laughs> I'm I am not a drawing instructor clearly, but <laughs> I can try. Yeah, good good for any type of artist to do, honestly. Unless you just like solely draw landscapes, but I mean like honestly? I guess you're still having benefits. If nothing else still loosens you up, because you have to draw really fast. And like, any type of artist can get really bogged down with like, trying to perfect certain details, and this like kind of trains it out of you. A little bit. I don't know what the equivalent would be for like landscape type stuff. I mean, there's definitely like stuff you can do with that, uh, which is more like color blocking, I suppose. I'm not really experienced with that. Which, you know. And something that I'm that I was like trying to correct right there is that like a lot of times with gesture drawing you want to make sure the overall like low of the pose, which is like I you see I draw the head and then um, just like a squiggly line for like generally how the body's being posed. You want that to be no more complex than like a C or an S. Because anything more than that, you start to lose the energy and it gets like too like wobbly and detailed and all that nonsense. You can add in more detail, obviously, once you start to really go into the pose to like accurately represent it, but you want to like do your best to maintain that, um, same, like, the SRC Corp. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I think, about I think I know what you're talking about. I mean, honestly, like, there's a lot of good, like, literally just, like, trying out exercises for different types of mediums like it's you're gonna learn something even if you end up being like eh, actually actually i want to do this it is funny i had one art teacher in i think my first drawing class in college that's like completely fucking wrong <laughs> um, and, uh, that class is focused more on static objects and landscapes and stuff like that. Um, and you looked at what I was drawing and, like, how well, like this guy again, uh, how well I was doing and he just was, like, instantly, like, you are, like, a character artist. You are, you, you would have a lot more fun drawing people. You clearly, like, aren't into this and, you know, the few opportunities where we did draw people in that class, he could, like, instantly tell yeah the program loves <clears throat> act fan as well yeah 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 exactly kane like any practice like obviously certain mediums have like certain practices for a reason it's not like you know you can just do whatever and it'll work equal well but like nothing is a waste you never know when you might need to use those skills within like a different medium as well even a character artist will still need to paint some backgrounds. 
Maybe not paint, but like, whatever, you know? But yeah, he's like, the rare opportunities where we did drive people, he's like, he can instantly tell he's like having way more fun and was like way more investment. And he's like, yeah, I can tell this just isn't your thing. So like, I understand, do your best, but I understand. <laughs> and it was like validating um, that he could tell so easily. That was just like, yeah, just going through the paces with like, what your class has to offer, you do not have much to work off of. <laughs> yeah, this really is the just woke up. Model who just woke up. I just woke up. I don't like... <laughs> I guess I could go off like the fabric flow, which would be fun. But it's, it's a little late for that, it's about to end. Woke up like this. <laughs> yeah, I know. It's like, if you're not sure what you want to do, but you know you want to draw, like, it's it's, it's obvious, but just try shit. Because, like, it's just going to be more effective than, like, trying to think out, like, oh, do I want to do this? Do I want to do this? Do I want to do this? Do I want to... Because it's like... Then obviously, like, also do your best to think outside the box in terms of, like, huh, I like this aspect of this, but not this. So, like, is there something that would... That I can do that would cross all those... Things I do like together and not... Whatever. You know. It's tough, though. It's It takes a long ass time sometimes. To really know, know. Guy's such an energy, I love him. This <laughs> dude! Look at this guy. Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of just rambling, but. You know. Do your best. Trying new things is good. Which is to have the reason why I'm playing on doing landscapes after this, because, like, I never do those. And it shows. So it's, it's just a good thing to fix. Yeah, I mean, we... I can't remember if I actually had a class where I did, like... What did I always already switch to... <laughs> I was just so ready for it to switch over. Um, I don't remember if I had a class where I did proper landscapes. Cause I, I mean, I said it out for the other class, but it was more so... Still life and that kind of thing. Obviously, it's kind of a tall order for, like, a college class if you want, like, real reference. <laughs> but... I mean, I guess, I guess we did, like, go to the museum and, like, draw stuff in there, or, like, go outside and stuff like that. Here and there. Can't remember if it was in that class specifically. I, yeah, I think it was. I definitely remember the still life better, though. So, obviously, that's easier to coordinate than just, like, Getting a bunch of college kids and being like, yep, just go wherever you want in this museum. <laughs> you know, fi find something on this floor and draw it, like, whatever. Now look at this guy. Yeah, really does look like a Batman villain. Yes, King, destroy Gotham City. I know things about superheroes. Probably.
feet are actually very like together from that angle. Y yeah? Yeah, me too. Yeah, you know it's like that sometimes. Got super drunk last night and found my bed in the sink pose. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, this is definitely the morning after and like, oh shit. <laughs> Probably better than the ground over there though. Just look at it. At least there's water to make him uh, uh, sensibly clean and a drain. <laughs> you sure is arting. I am. Hi, Connie. Can you believe it? Can you believe your parfait would ever art? I've gotten turn more than he actually is, but that's fine. I'm glad he can believe it. I know, I know. But thank you for the yeah. Now I really gotta look through like jobless yeah, things now. I'm thinking about the art and my actual career path book. Gotta build up my portfolio again, though, because, like, it's kind of... It's kind of... Could be... Fill that a bit better. I just need to get back to making work. He's like, not that this isn't, but, like... Relevant work to show up. <laughs> I'll look at there. Maybe, maybe next week that'll be the deal for the art stream. Do some nonsense. E yeah. This dude, this dude was just walking along and he suddenly stopped and looked at me for no reason. He thinks he recognizes me, but he doesn't. I just look uh, similar to a cashier you had once. What have you do? I've been told by a customer that I look like identical to someone I knew, which was something. At least they didn't think I was the person, but <laughs> like, huh? Doppelganger's real, I guess. You are the inferior axe man, I'm sorry. It's, you can't you can't beat my guy. He's a town guard, yeah, yeah, honestly. Yeah, he, he did have a little bit of the like oblivion like dude turns to you and starts talking. After having been just like walking through the street, kind of luck. There's Nyax. Good 
Dude's built though, I'll give him that. This is dynamic, though. This is a pose. Uh, upper to legs are mostly in sync. like <laughs> yeah when he fight against the other axe man yeah I wish I was holding a big orange cat right now <clears throat> Gus can hit you while you're flying. I... I guess that makes sense. I I didn't know this. But I guess that makes sense. That's right, though. There are a good couple moves that can hit through that invulnerability. God, remember Sky Battles? Those existed for about two seconds. And, like, are probably the reason why I didn't even do the arms. Why, um, Random Pitchy hit me with the early using fly. Hurricane, Sky Uppercut, Thunder. I got. Sky Uppercut is wild to think about. Like, it obviously makes sense given the name, but. But yeah, I feel like Sky Battles are entirely to blame for Zatu's model being posed like that. Cause like all the bird type, the, the the bird Pokemon had to be flying for it. So, and now that's not really. I mean, I guess it makes it easier to do the animations like fly. But. Swift still hits. Guarantee it to hit, you know? I, I get I guess they really weren't lying about the guarantee. You use protect. The opponent uses swift. It still hits. Swift never misses. Swift never misses or your PP back, guaranteed. Should be the last one. When it starts to load. Gen 6 also had reverse battles, and I think we've gotten that like in a in a very limited way that like once or twice since then that was neat there's a lot of like weird things you had to do for that shit if i recall no guard mod champs would just one shot of knock off <laughs> for uh dragon ball using shadow force ah in gretel I'm gonna take a look at the uh, images I got that I downloaded on the internet. Let's see if there's anything actually good in here. Right, yep. Yeah. Never fucking miss, baby. Unfucking touchable. 
Uh, I have to extract it. It's like cup. It's a couple of gigabytes. <laughs> uh, that's supposed to make sense. It's like a photo collection. That's one I've applied for like free. I'm just like, I think I will. But Pokemon's a weird game, isn't it? Ooh, fuck he has more sapphire. Let's fucking go. Yeah, what should, what what number would this be? That is very fair, though. <laughs> Number nine. Yeah, I, I, I do recall there's a certain mainstay in all of your teams. If if if, if I'm not wrong. For just perhaps you know like you you might have had like a bit of a preference <laughs> and that's very fair Gatamara is like fucking powerful gotta love him Anyone ever says you're out of our own overrated, tell them you're right, but they fuck. So, uh, die? I'm just doing this while I wait for this, um, folder to extract. They're popular because they're good as shit. Calm lines and double themes and Drake Steven. Yeah, that would kill, wouldn't it? Fucking ruinous. Want to use a guard of our own team again? It's been a minute for me. I guess I can get out my my old one from um, Emerald. And just train her up now that we have bottle caps and uh, all that shit. I could probably do something. Your main looks awfully similar to what I'm drawing. I don't know what you're talking about. What I'm drawing never has anything to do with what I'm saying. It's a. It's, it's here. My images. I'm gonna save this also. Cause that's smart to do. It is the 27th. Okay. Now wait, is that folder? Got him. Um, oh, well, you know, considering my experience in the background, so I can gonna start with like one that's got like, clear shapes in it to mimic at the very least. Just looking through all these. Not that y'all can see it, but. This could be fun. These are all. Oh, this is huge, which I probably should have figured. Hi! You can't see me when I'm like this. These are all photos by uh, Noah Bradley that I'm using. Level 36 is in a level 58 guard war. Yeah, that's very fair. Soon, soon it will be small enough to actually fit on stream. Microsoft Word, yeah, really. I I put in an image and it just like <laughs> shoves everything on my stream to the side. 
I'm thinking like you look up there. Oh, you know what? I don't have my power goal on uh, this. I just realized I probably I probably should have that. It's probably a little bit important. I was like, huh, there's like nothing up here for me to worry about covering up with this. It's a nice pick. Yes. Uh, somewhere in New Zealand. That's all I know. Bottle cups. I was saying that like I could actually um, take my old Gardevoir from Emerald and <laughs> actually try to use it for something possibly. I mean, like I, I think you can change nature now too, I believe. So unless I wanted to do a build with the hidden ability or like egg moves or anything like that, make make a team literally just for to have an excuse to use the Gardevoir. That is it. <laughs> No other reason. It's just been a while since I've had any excuse. It'd be fun to, like, actually make something out of, um, my Gardevoir. I currently have her on Alpha Sapphire, and I do want to do the Battle Facility, name of which I'm forgetting. I don't think she's particularly useful for that, based on what I've looked up in the past um but i don't know like i do i do uh, i sort of do it just so i sort of want to do it just so i can like actually have the like upgrade a trainer card but i don't know not of effort to put into a quote unquote older game Okay, I am going to get the dimensions off of this so I can have that. For reference. I also want to do like battle facilities in Emerald too. Because I've done like Silver Symbol Battle Pike, but that's like, it's... I, I might have I might have gone the the one with Chuck I don't think I did. I know I like I like him, I think he's seen it, but like I don't think I actually ever got to him and beat him. But I like the battle frontier. I'd like to actually, you know, um <laughs> do the battle frontier. Well, if I'm gonna do that, I should probably not have it low opacity. Well, I won't even bother making a clip to that. I suppose I could also like divide it into um, <clears throat> sections have a better sense of where everything is, but. I'll try eyeballing everything first just to see. Generally where the water line is, is about like a third of the way up. And then the mountains go up to just over that the, the further ones, just over the halfway point. Yeah, I have no illusions of using my old team members in, like, an actual competitive team, but, like, get them all set for, like, a battle facility would be fun. You know? Get, letting them see a little bit of glory. I think it'd be neat. I'm trying to be too far to... Well, there is also this part of the mountain over here. Yeah, I think I'm drawing them too big. No shame in just shrinking them. So yeah, they stretch to 
basically the midpoint of the image, if you count to the like rightmost section of the like the, the these ones, the these mountains. So it should be like ruffling. A little bit taller. Eh. But yeah, I know. Transferring Pokemon up from Gen 3 at this point is, um, adjourning. Fortunately, I would only have to do, um, like one transfer at this point, since I'd just be moving them from bank to home. But. I'm still not ready to move them out of Hoenn again. <laughs> Gonna be waiting until we actually get another set of games set in Hoenn. So I can bring them home again. Because that was very satisfying. I, I transferred them up into like... Gen 4 and Gen 5, Gen 6. And then actually being able to bring them home was very sweet. Just like my team from uh, Emerald in general, I mean. Gen <laughs> it was cool how um, Omega Ruby Apple Sapphire commemorated that by letting you get the little certificate. Suck that you could only do it with one Pokemon at a time, but like I get it. The line of the shore isn't like perfect. You can see a little like. Well, it's pretty straight though. Might actually be. I guess I'm more just like the use curve in right there. It's more of a gap over here. But it doesn't need to be perfectly accurate. Is an inspiration. Well, a little more than inspiration, but still. There's also the boat. But I don't want to do that today. And not feeling that. And this has like the divot over here ish. That's all, you know, going in a bit. That's like a good enough for a sketch. I guess I could do actual like blocking now. Um, do I want a color pick or do I just want to use my eyes? Always the question. Do I trust my eyes? Lay down. Darkest color here. Make this brush a bit bigger. Although that lags the shit out of it, unfortunately. Look at all big canvases. Yeah, I don't like... <clears throat> the look of it. I think I need to turn the... Gen 
So yeah, maybe character density. Yeah, still not really. I think I want to just use more of that. Yeah, that's fun. Yeah. Gotta try a million things before I feel... I, I feel it. Thank you for the hydrates. Goddamn Malwarebytes notification over on my screen. Like, get out there. Don't need that on the same. I'm done locking in all these. Make this bigger again. It should be more cooperative now that I don't have like a texture I'm working with. Yeah, it's more like it. Oh, that might be good to do the like the going way up high past the frame. Um, the Cliff sides first. Mountain sides and all that. And then doing the like perfect line with the water. Well, yeah. Get the snow in there later. Yeah, I keep I keep seeing like my friends talking about competitive Pokemon stuff and like thinking like maybe I care again. It's, maybe I should, but I've got quite quite a bit else that I'm trying to do at the same time. So it's um We'll see. Just piling absolutely everything I've ever wanted to do on my plate for all, all at the same time. The Barbara spirit. I am trying. Doing my best. I mean, Barbara spirit does entail just doing your best with what you can do. So, I mean. Honestly, I'd be down for doing a Bob Ross watch and stream. <clears throat> watch and draw. I think it is. I would have to check. I think you can just like use that and you won't get like searched for it. Not that you'd get sued for anything on twitch.tv, but like, you know. I think it is public domain. Or free to, you know, not public domain, but like, <laughs> hell yeah, fuck him up, Cossack. Like, I think you can at least do like art stream type stuff and then you're not gonna get in trouble. So that could be an idea. Someday. Done that before ish with a friend having a party where we all painted stuff while watching Bob Ross. He was very pleasant. Hmm. <laughs> 
<laughs> Love the Gen 3 AI. Perfect. There's nothing wrong with it. Not annoying at all. It was definitely too blue, but... Eh. Green it up a little bit. And that's like a lot more green over here. Yeah, that feels better. Not dark enough, but better. Not super worried about it as long as as long as we got the color in there, and we know there's water there. X specials instead of X events. Uh-oh. Hey, better prepared than me going into Elite Four. You actually bought that kind of stuff. I kind of, I kind of just like forget that exists. Or like, just like, well, I'm, I'm never gonna be in that serious of a battle. As if he can use it in, like, <laughs> anything that truly matters. Part of the contingency, uh, yeah, yeah, fair. Then yeah, I might be, I, I'm doing the, like, <clears throat> all this backwards. Because I just see something I'm like, oh, I want to do that first. But, um, get this guy in there. Not like these outlines really matter. <laughs> <clears throat> uh, yeah, Ariel Ace. I, I can see how that'd be frustrating. I guess I could draw behind it on another layer, but... Yeah. What if I didn't? No, it's more saturated blue, actually. Very pretty. Oh yeah, it would just like, completely ignore double themes. Yeah, that that is a little bit of a problem, isn't it? I wish you luck. Oh, brave fool. Try to get these general shapes from all the shadows in here. <laughs> Just spam healing. Yeah, you know, fair enough. Always works. You know, I thought I admit I'd struggled on, um, <laughs> uh, it's a brilliant diamond in Elite Four. I was like, oh, right. This shit's actually, like, tough. I almost beefed to Cynthia. Because <laughs> I was just fully not prepared. I was, like, booking it through the game because I was like, I just want to have, like, ha you know, finish this. So I'm ready to do, like, events and such. Was not prepared for, uh, Pokemon game to be challenging. <laughs> oh, 
only because I hadn't, you know, prepared and brought in shit, but like... She's got a reputation for a reason. Love you, queen. Please don't kill me, queen. Makes me glad I'm not trying to do a Nuzlocke on, um, <clears throat> Platinum or something. Again! We'll see how the Elite Four and Unova treats me, even though I don't have to do the champion. Cause, uh, huh. It'd be sad if I <clears throat> beefed it there, but like... It's also... You know, gonna be the place where you would beef that light in the, into the game. <laughs> Kane Hellcat, thank you for the follow! Hope you're having a good time. Hell yeah, though. Yeah, I, I like I went and being like, yeah, whatever. It's a Pokemon game, and not only that, it's a remake in Gen 8, so... What could happen? Well, what could happen is it's uh, pretty accurate to the originals and difficulty wise, and actually, the leveling curve, although it's been awful up until now with experience all, kind of kind of levels out about then. <laughs> My BDSM, I mean BDSP. Yeah. Yeah, but also fair. <laughs> Connie? <laughs> Connie! <laughs> Connie with the unfollow, refollow, ultimate strat. Thank you for the follow, Connie! Yeah, that's what that stands for, Connie. I'm glad we all know. Not a well known acronym. The ultimate fucking play. <laughs> Never let them know what you're gonna do next. You know what it's about. Miku, good to see you. What am I gonna do for like <laughs> dotting the trees so that I don't die? Cause that could be it. How does this hold up? Yeah, is this eh no. Extra blender. I mean maybe. It's like, what is that even? Doesn't do much. It's it's kind of such an imposter. Imposter. It might just be because of um how big my canvas is. Yeah, it's like okay, I sort of see what's doing now, but yeah, it's very subtle. Pick a next team. Okay, okay, okay. Time to look. Time to open up the Discord. Ooh. Ooh, I'm into that. 
It's fun. Fuck yes, Armory though. Let's fucking go. Drag wash? Does that look at all decent? I'll use it like a brighter color so I can really see it. Nah. Like I really need a um good texture for that. So really hits. What am I gonna do? Do your best. I believe in you. Cause I could, I could look through and see. Um, don't have any like particularly good. Textures to create that. Don't want to go through and like individually put in all the trees because that'd be kind of. I'm like, I know there has to be a better option, but I don't know enough about painting in this program to know what it is. Oh, that's awful. Oh, look at it go. You can't see my mouse right now, but it's like... Very calming after Ultimate Frog. I believe it. <laughs> I hope everything went well with Ultimate Frog. I mean, it's Ultimate, so I can, you, you know, but... Ooh, right. Stuff that learns False Wipe. Forgot about that. I mean, gonna go over this with like the shadow again, and then go from there. I think. Let's see how the the gouache feels. Gwashi. Just needs to be enough so I can actually work with um, the tree sheets. <laughs> Density of pain needs to go up, for sure. Amount of pain, yeah. Got your ass beat by Thor Denver for a good five hours. <laughs> this of your life, yeah, yeah. That that is the life of an ultimate raider, isn't it? I don't think I'd ever have the willpower. I respect it very much. I've done Savage, but I wasn't, like, good at it. So... I know my limits. I'm gonna look forward to actually seeing the like face changes and just like enjoying them from second, you know, second hand. Cause those are always neat. Leave 
basically seeing all the cool work put into the uh, ultimates. Wish the one like really good group wasn't so paranoid about other people stealing their techniques and their knowledge and beating them to world first, because it'd be, be cool to watch them. Even as someone who generally doesn't do that. But regardless. I mean, Latias would be worth the Master Ball. Let's make no mistake. Yeah, it's a little patch up. Use gun. That is a realistic option. Just you wait for them to add the gun Pokemon, which is just another- Well, actually, we have that, don't we? We have Remoraid in Octillery. And I'm sure there's others that I'm blanking on. We yeah, they got natural defenses. By being guns. Never gave us Pokemon gun. Yeah, right. What are they thinking? really missed out, you know? I'm sure there's some way we could convolutedly justify the DLC since that is the third version as being Pokemon Gun. <laughs> Legendary is just a dog with a Glock. Like, what are they doing? It'll be interesting to see if they go back to doing third versions with Scarlet and Violet, because I feel like they probably won't, just because, like, it makes so much more sense to do DLC. And, like, personally, I'm over not having a third version. I prefer the DLC. I prefer spending $20 and not having to play through the entire game over again. But, like, <laughs> I use Aerial Ace for the first entrance. <laughs> He's been kind to you. Beating time... Understandable. Please survive. But, like, it's also a uh, game freak, and they might just be like, um, actually, we're just gonna... You know how we did something last gen which was debatably good? Um... What if we just didn't? I'm sure if I had a bigger platform... I catch a ton, ton of flack for calling uh, no third version is good, but it's... Yeah, like, I don't understand Scarlet and Violet either. It's not a, dual a duality. Like all the other titles. It doesn't really make sense. It seems goofy. I don't know what the third version would be in this case. Amber. Because orange definitely doesn't overlap with- I mean, I guess it's the other side of red. So it would make sense in that respect. 
I'm glad we have the same idea. But yeah, I know, like... For me, what the DLC is like... Yeah, I would prefer direct sequels like Black 2, White 2, because that was cool as hell, but I know... I'm not delusional enough to think that there is any reasonable chance we'd ever get that again, so... Second best option... $20, I get all the new shit and don't have to replay the game. That's just for me. It sucks, though, that, um... Sword and Shield didn't get a direct sequel, because, like... There were, uh, several trainers who became gym leaders by the end of it, or were slated to become, or had, like, a future job lined up. Like, Hop was gonna become a, a professor, uh, Beta was gonna be, um, a gym leader. Or he, like, he he was by the end of it, but he didn't fight him as one. Um, Avery and Clara, um, I think both became gym leaders by the end of it. Or were slated to, uh, uh you know, take out that position. Um... It's like, you know, like... Say what you will about the story, but there there was potential for, like, seeing the world grow in the sequel. Even if we... I guess there's the argument of, like, we, we know where everyone's going, but... I don't know. But hell yeah, let's fucking go! Sorry, that was late. I was stupidly thinking about... Pokemon <laughs> Sword and Shield. Hell yeah! You're done! In the Hall of Fame once again. <laughs> just, just pulled out the book like that. <laughs> hey, if it works. Steven can't complain, right? No, he could complain a little bit. Normally, being a champion is like, you beat me fair and square, but when you pull up the other, like... Legally, I have to say this, but it's not really true. Like, you did just pull out a gun on my Pokemon. Wish I had a better idea. I've had to get that, like, more rough texture for, like, the... The, the stuff over here. Because, like, the dry paint feels like it should be the way to go, but... It's hard to actually get it to show up. I don't know shit about this. There's a lot of red in it, though. All that iron deposits on the mountainside, or what have you. I, I know about this ship. Actually, I will see what the dry glass for. I'm putting back all the all of this. Yeah, I, I I understand what you mean. Like, the music is definitely, like, the part that's really, like... 
It hits. Y years and years and years after the fact. Ooh, yeah, the credits theme. I, yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. That shit was good. I'm not sure how long I've had my emerald cartridge, but it's, it's been a hot minute. Since like elementary school, I would assume. Because I know I got it before <clears throat> all the DS games came out. I think I think I got it after release. I'm not sure how close, because like I was still a little kid and so it's like <laughs> didn't necessarily follow game news because I didn't really know how. Mm, 17 years since it came out. Yeah, it's sad. I would have no clue. Uh, 2005, I would have been... 8 years old. 17 since you got... Oh, okay, 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 okay. Yeah, when it was... Oh, right, duh, Sapphire. Yeah, Emerald was... Two thousand five. Okay, yeah, North America. That was two thousand five. Um. Yes, that's. If I had gone around that to be. Seventeen. Well, I mean. It it is coming up on the seventeenth anniversary of um, Emerald's release in the U.S. Yeah, it was it says it's 2004 in in Japan, but yeah, like I said, I don't know if I got the release. I probably didn't, but yeah, it's more relevant for me. The silly little American. Wish that I knew where my um. That far card had gone to, but it was probably eaten by a dog. Cause he liked to do that. Still hold that hope that someday my parents will be like leaning those and be like, "Oh hey, this probably this probably belongs to Parfait." Maybe someday. Yeah, would have been eight when, um, or would have been seven when Emerald came out. I think. Yeah, math. Don't mind me doxing myself on the internet. <laughs> You know, I have an approximate range of my birth date. Do with it what you will. Yeah, I'm 24. Right on target. Hey, thanks. Yeah, I figured with the uh, ages you were given for the, the, the when you would have gotten it, but. I imagine I do attract that audience largely too. Because it feels like early mid 20s is a lot of like niche streamer viewers, you know? Like the type of people who would watch small streamers on Twitch. I, d I know I have some technically younger folks. Not, not like young, young, but like. 
a little babier, but um, if I had to guess. This seems to be like a bit here. I think it's like too saturated. <laughs> Make you feel old? Yeah, hello. You're like one of the exceptions, I think. <laughs> I'm sorry to say. Hey, Miku, thank you for the resub. Let's fucking go. Five whole months. Dang. It's been a while. Yeah, but unfortunately, all you're in a stream full of babies. All infants over here. Formal babysitter stream. Make sure we don't do anything dangerous. Pleasant place saying it. I'm glad. I'm glad. That's what I tried to be. The fully young and energy doesn't make it so. I don't think many people care too much about that though. <clears throat> Gives me something for people to tease me over, which is like ideal as a YouTuber. But there are some young folks in the VTuber scene for better or worse. Like, I can't talk, but... <laughs> Tease, you say? <laughs> oh, classic. Honestly, it's like... I'm genuinely really honored that people... Just like like to go to my stream to just like chill late night kind of thing like or like at at work or whatever else like when i hear them like wow me and like not anybody else <laughs> not saying i think my content is bad but like hearing people say they would pick me still you know Feels worth it. I think I do remember when you first got here, but you've, you've been here a minute. I'll say that. Long time Parfait Watcher.
Which is also, you know, like, something to be able to say. I think about the fact that my uh, anniversary is coming up in, like, less than a month now. Which... Is... <laughs> it's something to think about. Like, wow, I've actually been doing this for a significant length of time. Feel the way about that. I've been having fun, so it's like it's a good thing. But also, wow. Oh, Priscilla and Lily, right. Yeah, I remembered about when you came in, but not like the actual source. Yeah, I remember that from, like, months ago, which is probably a little bit of an understatement. Time is a funny thing. Seven months ago today? Wow. Yeah, I guess he could just tell from Apollo Age. When... That would make sense. Over half a year. I've been going at this a while, haven't I? Yeah, time flies even faster, you get older. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's true. Sucks. But it's true. Yeah, but I mean, it's nice coming up on anniversaries and that kind of thing and knowing like, I've got like real experience doing this, you know? I can actually say that and I can see it. It is cool. Wow, maybe I'm like... Could be approaching being good at this kind of thing. I don't know. Maybe someday. I want like really little tiny flex to maybe yeah maybe it'd be a silly way to oh this might work this the the pointillism pen maybe do that and do over a bigger brush size as well. It's a bit too much. But that does feel nice. Make the particles a bit bigger. Brush a bit bigger, spread them out a bit more again. Very calm water, so I'm not sure why I'm doing like this video like up and down. I think it inadvertently made it look like that with like the light shine. It made the wire look more green than it is, but like that's nice though. That is a good strat. Not not that I would know, but that do, that does seem like a 
that shit would work well. Maybe someday I will be this good at strategies in Pokemon. I, I just need to get back into, like, thinking about that kind of thing, because, like, it's neat. It's cool. I sure did do, like... Be be I very casually dip my toes into competitive Pokemon way... way long ago. I get these to be. Yes, okay, right, right, right. Double deck of this condition, ignore the burn attack condition. Ooh. Ooh, right. Oh, shit. Yeah, like I remember vaguely. Like what Facade did, but like, dang. Yeah, that that would that would fuck. Gotta be honest. Just sounds like a good strategy. want, like, fewer particles, though. So... I mean, this is fine. Then can do, like... If I want to do the jet stream when I'm not even doing the boat, I don't know. Yeah, no, I don't blame you. Aggron's great. Like, I don't... Generally, I tend to, like... Really cutesy Pokemon, but Agron. I'm attached. I won't deny it. Yeah, it is worse for type coverage, but Agron. Really loving the pointillism brush. I have to, I have to say, quite nice. I can say pretty much. Ooh, so move wise, still pretty good. Hmm. Maybe still fine then. I think I'm gonna. This will fuck with shit and I'll have to even it out, but this is like not blue enough. I'll, I'll worry about specific little segments. The whole thing. Needs to be blued. I'll fade it out. Oh, that is really good type coverage. That's surprising. The guy can do a lot. Yeah, have all the steel types, all the like fully all the steel type, you know, that 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 kind of Pokemon. It just it just feels like a friend, you know, just like particularly, Agron. It's like I trust someone. Yeah, it is still like not the best option for a lot of those. That is very fair. I want to do overlay. Maybe more 
the lights. Eh. Like that kind of thing, yeah. I find the right balance. Feels about right. I suppose a like a surprising amount of Pokemon can learn um Thunderbolt, it feels like. Might have to check that shit, but like I do recall that being the case. Oh, that's right! Camera would be really useful for all that. Now you mention. I'm gonna square up all this. Yeah, I, I forgot the uh, camera I've done uh, just offhand. <laughs> In my defense. <laughs> Yeah, no, I've never used a camera, but I have no doubt that they fuck. Little killers, eh, very small. I up as fuck just about your dad because since the time is 420, he'll never change. So true! Hell yeah! Uh, I tried to replace the battery in my copy of Emerald once and like it didn't break anything, which was nice, but it definitely didn't fix the clock. So that sucked. Definitely something where I can literally just like go in and do it again. And hopefully as an adult do a bit of a better job, but yeah. I don't think there is much risk of affecting the safe file if you do that, though. Because it's not, you know, Gen 2. Where those two are hooked together. It's literally like, as long as you don't buff up the, um, anything else on the cartridge as you're doing it, it's probably fine. Do I, why not actually try the pointillism for all this? See if that does more of what I'm looking for. And I like the brush a bit bigger. Yeah, that feels good. It's like this kind of... Make it a brighter color so you can see it. I just want to give it some color variation. I mean, it's a little bit. A little bit what I'm looking for. Need to make the particles bigger, though. Point to some brush fucks. Things I learned. What I learned in landscape class is... Is... I definitely need to get to the point where my landscapes aren't just like bleh misses of color, you know, but eh. Staff Health can be taught Dragon Planet special. Ooh, fuck. Yeah, that sounds like a kill, just a little bit. That sounds that that sounds a bit powerful. Uh, 
Oh, you want type coverage on your starters? Oh, you want fucking type coverage? Dragon type, fucker. Also learns pursuit. Cool, fuck. Sipjot's got a good move set. Like, I, I don't generally look into Pokemon move sets, so I can't be like, hmm. I didn't know that, because, like, that, that applies to um, everything, but, like. <laughs> they said this Pokemon can and will destroy. Honestly, uh, Sepdal was never, like, my favorite of the Gen 3 starters, so I was always, um, Swampert and, like... I... M I'm, like, my, my next choice between them it would be Blightskin, but, like, more for Torchic, you know? But, like, using, uh, Sepdal in, in, uh, Alpha Sapphire definitely helped me appreciate it a lot more. It's, like... I like, I like it a lot. It's got such a solid design. Gotta love a gecko. I always have fun coming up with the themes for my names. Even if it's something silly. I suppose that's obvious, but... It's obvious that I do that, especially considering my um, Mystery Dungeon playthroughs, but like... Yeah, it's like, it, it helps a lot, I find. Just like, restricting your options by a lot. What would be a good theme? I always like go towards food themes, like types of pastries and stuff. Something about my brain. Flavors of food, um, that kind of thing. Could go with like types of flowers, which would be very pretty. Oh, I mean, after your friends is cute though. For a while, I just used like regular real people names, which worked because like it felt like reasonable, you know. Didn't feel out of place. But it did get, like, a little boring, but also, like, it gave me a good excuse to, like, find new names that I had just, like, never heard before. Especially for Alola, because, like... Culture Inspiration gives, like, a very obvious, like, theme to go with. Which I hope isn't too, like, y you know, white touristy, but, like... Broadening my worldview, you know, what I know about. Did you see flashback? <laughs> when you first spawn, you encounter four key balls with some shiny purple. Oh no! Oh, that's awful. I'm so sorry to the you of uh, s several rounds ago. And the you have now. Uh, let me need a middle. I've been so fortunate in never having 
encountered like a hard to capture shiny, but like Yeah, Arceus does make it a lot easier, doesn't it? I I still need to finish the game so I can actually start shiny hunt. I'm like not even I got to the Fire Island and I completed that little bit of the plot. Is the last thing I remember doing. I think I unlocked the next area. So I've got a lot to do. I've been distracted. <laughs> By so many other things. Need to do that before I get any more of the plot spoiled for me. Because I've definitely heard some things. I'll get there. I'll get there before uh, Scarlet and Valley come out for sure. That that uh, that is what I can guarantee. I can't believe you've done this, Elo. I can't believe you spoiled the entire plot of Legends Arceus for me. What am I gonna do now? With my life? What's the point of it all? There's Pokemon in the game? Fuck! I haven't gotten there yet! 69 EXP for downing Maze Torchic! <laughs> Amazing! Perfect. For a study, for a late night study, I'm relatively satisfied with where I'm at. And I do still need some rest. I'm like most of the way feeling good after being sick for um a day or two, but I don't want to be like, ha, I'm fine. He stays up late, dies. So I might call this pretty good, even though it's only been two hours, but, you know. Mostly reach, reach, bleh, reach 10 star without leaving the opening star zone. Me, 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 me. I got so into catching every single Pokemon and fulfilling research missions, and I was like, wait, I have to actually do the plot. <laughs> Oops. Help for surviving, like, um, what are they called? The distortions, you know? Say that much. The game team is relatively prepared for, you know, the fact that a lot of people are gonna do that. But yeah. A good drawing session, I think. I will bring this up a bit better. Can't find my damn mouse, so I'm gonna bring up my uh, tablet pen again. Why oh, is it not letting me? 
Okay. Turn off the actual reference. Not amazing, but it's good practice. Happy enough. So. <laughs> I thought it was just about wandering fire mind to find power inside each Pokemon. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I only know that you need a certain star level to progress because I did. I, I went to the second era area. I, I unlocked that pretty early. Or like, so I had to rank up a bit for the first zone. And then after that point, I just went wild and never had to deal with that shit again. Anyway. Good drawing. Good chatting. So I think. Nice charter stream. We'll see if anyone's. We'll see if more people are live right now, like considering. I somehow still follow too many people who go to sleep at, as early as um, 6 a.m. CST. Don't know how that happened. So I'll take a look around, see who's still up. Yeah, thanks for joining me for more art. Like I said, next 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 art stream next week, I might do um storyboarding if I can come up with uh, good concepts to do with that. Otherwise, some practice will still go. But yeah, or maybe I'll actually come up with emote ideas. <laughs> I do want to fill those, at least. Okay, hope everyone has a good time zone. Oh, shit. Uh, Wiggly and Liss are still doing their, um... Pokemon tier list. <laughs> I have to send y'all over to that. Especially since I don't get the opportunity to raid Wiggly often. So I'll set that up. Go say hi, go spam them with emotes. Again, have a good time zone, and tomorrow night we're gonna do some VLR finally after missing out on it. Because I was feeling. <laughs> Which is so sad because I want to. I am desperate to see more. Desperate to see more. Let's see if I can talk. Good thing about the stream, right? Anyway. See you tomorrow. Bye bye.